Hey yo, what's good, man? It's your boy Derry Branch here at Strike7Sports.com. Today's video, I just want to quickly talk about uh, Demary Franklin transferring over to Memphis. I had to uh, update the video because the last one I uploaded with no sound on it. So I had to go ahead and delete it and do another one. But the guys, um, from what I read about the kid, he's a two way guard, man, combo guard. Average uh, 17.8 points per game, um, 53.9, I believe, field goal percentage, 29 percent um, from beyond three beyond the uh, three-point line. So he's a scorer. You know, um, he can uh, score three different ways. Uh, I mean, I don't know if he's, um, I don't know if this solved the uh, main A. Cod issue where part of it was expecting uh, you're going to use him as a uh, in the starting five as a player that can do a lot of things for the team. But it uh, gives Memphis a score. He's not a wing guy. But he's a scorer. Um, I've read some uh, couple of announcers online, man, from a few accounts, and they think these guys he can start. He's gonna be in the starting five over um, a guy like Alo. Um, I have no issue with that. You know, uh, I still believe Alo is an asset to this team that they can use. Veteran guy, guy that knows Penny system. So there you have it. Um, I think this is good, man. I think this is a good move, man. It's like I think. I believe this is like the sixth transfer that Penny will be uh, having. That Penny's uh, got. Um, oh, fortunately, fortunately, the, um, there's a uh, issue with his eligibility, with uh, Franklin's eligibility. But from the quote I read, he's confident that he's going to get it from the NCAA. And if not, um, he won't be available until the uh, 2023 season. 2020, yeah, 2022. 2023 season next the following year. Also, uh, Jamar, Jamar Young is supposed to be coming. Still coming to the program from what I've uh, read. And um, if this guy, you can get this guy on the court, man, and that wave of go is true and they sign off on it. It's great for the program. It adds a, uh, another score outside of Kendrick Davis. You had, you was going to have that with uh, Acott, but he ain't coming. He's doing, uh, he got flipped at the last minute to a uh, Western Kentucky, it is what it is, whoop de whoop. And I think it's a great addition, man. A guy that can score, um, play both ways. I don't know what he is as a defender. Uh, run protector, he's not a wing player, but we still got to see how Penny is going to address that situation going forward. So I'm not, I wouldn't stress out too much about losing man in the car. I still think in the AAC, man, I think it's a going to be a week in the week uh, conference compared to last season. Last year was pretty down. So I think only, you know, uh, like a definite, you know, two good teams out there are going to be uh, Memphis and uh, Houston. SMU, for I mentioned, won't be a factor this year because they pretty much got raided by uh, <laughs> Memphis with their, uh, their props, the transfer talent. So we just got to see how things play out, man, how he builds the roster. I think this is the, all, all the uh, scholarships have been uh, taken up according to uh, the reports, I believe. So, outside of uh, the guy from uh, Italy, I think, Granja, everybody is a, it's a veteran related team. Man. So this guy is a fifth year senior. So, um, a lot of veterans on this team. So, we'll see how it plays out. I think it's a good basketball team. I think um, we have a good year. So, but uh, they're going to need to because that schedule, when it starts off with. It's tough, but there was, it's a tough schedule, out of conference schedule, but it's wonderful. So we'll see. All right, that's all I have for y'all for right now, man. Give me a like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Let me know how y'all feel. Also, check out my uh, Memphis basketball playlist, Memphis football and basketball playlist to, to listen to my uh, age content on those programs. Have a blessed day. Peace. Please subscribe.